If you're ready to do math today and you have your coffee ready, join me in the simultaneous sip. The question we're working on today is, determine whether the series is convergent or divergent, and it's the sum from n equals 2 to infinity of 1 over n times the natural log of n. Smash that like button and let's get started. The way we're going to solve this is with the integral test, which says suppose f is a continuous positive decreasing function on the interval 1 to infinity, and let a n equal f evaluated at n. Then the series of a n is convergent if and only if the improper integral, which is the integral from 1 to infinity of f of x dx, is convergent. So we want to see if the sum from n equals 2 to infinity of 1 over n times the natural log of n is a convergent or divergent series. So we'll let f of x be the function 1 over x natural log of x. And you can see this is always positive on our interval, it's decreasing on our interval, and it's continuous on our interval. And so maybe you might need to show a little bit of work to show it's decreasing, but just trust me for now, right? The denominator is increasing, so the function will be decreasing. So we want to evaluate the improper integral, the integral from 2 to infinity of 1 over x ln of x dx, which to evaluate improper integrals, we take a limit as a goes to infinity of the integral from 2 to a of 1 over x ln of x dx. And the way we evaluate this integral is with u substitution. We'll let u be natural log of x, so du is 1 over x. So really what we're evaluating is the integral of 1 over u, which we know is the natural log of the absolute value of u. So it's the limit as a goes to infinity. Here we're going to keep our bounds in terms of x just to keep it clean, which works out to be the limit as a goes to infinity of the natural log of the absolute value of u evaluated at x equals 2 and x equals a. Well, now let's switch back to the variable we started with. So it's the limit as a goes to infinity of the natural log of the absolute value of the natural of the natural log of x evaluated at 2 and a. And when we evaluate at a, we get the natural log of infinity, which is infinity, which means our integral diverges, and by the integral test, our series also diverges. Make sure to subscribe for more Coffee and Math with Dr. Wesselcouch. Don't text and drive. Bye-bye.